Okay, folks. Whoa. Back with you. What's going on over here? What? Why do I have... Ah, uh, I know what it is. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. All right. Back to normal. We are live from Pins and Pockets. It's the SoCal Tap Season Ender event at 32250 Mission Trail, Lake Elsinore, California, 92530. Check out Pins and Pockets. It's 92,000 square feet. It's big. It's pretty damn big. They got a lot of pool tables. Well, no, actually, they got five pool tables in one room, three pool tables in another room. They got a lot of bowling lanes is what they got. Anyway, pinsandpockets.com. Not pins and pockets, pins and pockets. We're going to start this match right now. Bud and Anthony. Bud and Tony. Voices, Sue and Tim. That's Tim breaking now. And I believe this is a race to three. Okay, I was just taking care of my tab. What do we got going on here? So Sue and Tim are in conference. Woo! Sue and Tim, and I tell you what. Don't be surprised if we see a couple of bank shots from Sue today. Don't be surprised if we see a couple of bank shots that go in from Sue today. She ain't, what is going on? I can't get one camera, one camera angle. That's all I want without someone standing in the freaking way. All right, so. This is Tony. This is not Bud. No. Bud has not changed a lot since you saw him in Kansas. <laughs> Bud is Tony's teammate. And Bud is not going to be shooting next because Tony missed. It's okay. This is a race to two. Race to two. Race to two. All right. I guess uh, shooting at the 10. 10 ball. 10 ball. It goes. Oh, with a bonus 14 ball shot in the corner. Was that? I hate it when that happens. I'd rather pop. Yeah. It changes things. Yeah, oh, look at this beautiful safety. And here comes Bud. Chum, dum, 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 dum. Bud, he's laughing it off because you know what? He ain't, they ain't leaving him with crap. 
Uh oh. What? What? Whoa, whoa! Look at this. One ball. He said, "Look at this shot!" Wow. Well, who? Where did this young prodigy come from? <laughs> Pull that out of your out of your hat. Hell of a shot there. Too bad he did miss. But uh, wow, I'm afraid of this guy. Keep him away from me. All right, that's okay. Tim and Sue. What's going on over here? All these people talking, milling around. Meanwhile, there's a wide open space over there. Sue's taking it all in right now. She doesn't see a lot of opportunity here. But that's all you got is air and opportunity. She takes the 11 for a walk. And look, she opened up the 8. Beautiful. Maybe she's just a good actress or a bad one. Oh, I thought she opened up the eight. The six is still there. Damn it, Jim. Tim's drawing out so that he can try to break this out. The six ball. And look at that. These guys are... <laughs> these guys are pretty good players. The dynamic duo. Sue and Tim. How many teams we got left? Four? Six. Six teams left right now. Thank you. Unfortunately, I think this cue ball has rolled a little bit beyond. Uh-oh. He's going to try to masse this ball around the two because it's frozen. Oh, my God. It's such a good shot. Look at that. Perfect. Sue, the pressure's on her. she got to make this ball. Long and straight shot. And Sue even drinking a beer. She knows how to make a ball like that. I'm scared of her. Did you get me online? Uh, no, they didn't. We we're only doing one table, really. We had you. We did have you in some of the camera angles, yeah. My better side, I hope. Probably your better side. Yeah, now, is this rewatchable later? Yeah, we'll put them on YouTube like within the next two weeks or so. Yeah, just look up. Uh, just look up POV pool. Go to YouTube, look up POV Pool, and uh, and then uh, uh, look up uh, SoCal Tap POV Pool. Okay, it should be up in a couple weeks. Take care. The glove lady has left the building. She got knocked out. She was hoping to get on a live stream table. I'm telling you, you know, these league players, they love it when they're being streamed. Look at this. Nice shot. Man. Come on. We want to see a good match here. 
We don't want to see no shutout. We want to see a little bit more Bud and Tony. Well, all right. If you guys play good, too, that's always nice. He was going to feather this ball. Oh. Sorry, it's 1-0. Score. I had the score wrong there. It's 1-0. Sue and Tim. Okay. Race the two. No. That was not psychic premonition. That was a typo. All right, so Bud and Anthony are back at the table. With Ballingham, they got choices now. I don't know about this. I don't know about taking the only open ball on the table. Especially with all those other balls tied up. Anthony now. He's got a look at the one ball, but then what, what are you going to shoot after that? That's the only problem. Look at this. Look at this guy playing a breakout. Completely threw me for a loop. Wow. First the Massé from God knows where. And then, and then this. A breakout on the 7-3. I think the 7 does go to the corner. So... I can very quickly tell that Bud is the stronger of the two of these players. Tony is taking advice from him. I think Tony is very aware, and so is Bud, aware of the fact that their opponents are very capable of running out and closing out the game on a miss. So they're trying to be careful here. So this is not the perfect cue ball because as we've seen in the past, Sue could very easily make this 11. But the four ball is uh, up against the rail and it covers the 14 ball. So I think we'll be seeing these guys visit the table. Or who knows? So far this guy, Bud. Oh. Oh, look at this. Unintentional safety there. However, the uh, I think the 14 can be banked. No, not to the side pocket. I think he covered most shots here. I don't think he can cut this 12 ball in the side. If he can, he's going to be taking away his breakout ball as well because the 12 is a good ball to keep around to break the 14 out. Now, another option is take a flyer at this 14, but I don't know. What? What? That was ridiculous. Jet, 
just, uh, are they still on the winter side or what? No, but they're still playing again. Uh, Can't let my action leave. <laughs> what? No. Well, we got a little back and forth on this game. What? Uh oh, he might call in sick. Nah, I'm not going to tell it. Okay. The four ball still covers the 14. So... For Sue and Tim, this game's far from over. But uh, Bud and Tony, they got the upper hand here. Bud needs to make a good shot happen right now. I mean, he, he could shoot at this three but he knows, he knows that he's messing with that 14. He's going to shoot at the six. Is he going to play it to miss it? Yeah, he's playing a safety, basically. He wants them to make that 12. Because that 12 ball serves as a breakout ball for the 14. And they missed. This 12 ball is still a good breakout ball. Bud needs to get into this game with uh, Tony here so that Tony doesn't make a bad decision. I mean, I'm not saying Tony won't, but they should think about this match like a team, like the way they're playing as a team. I think the four, four ball goes. Yep. Oh my God, he's he's overrolled. So now, what do you do here? What do you do here? Shoot the three right in front of the fourteen and make it happen all over again. I might consider doing that. He's looking at that. Oh, he banked it. It went in. I was so surprised. I didn't even know you were calling that shot. Is it slop counts? It wasn't slop. I called it that. Oh, wow. He called it. He called it to that pocket. I had no idea he was, was going to call that. I didn't even know the shot was on. I was looking at only a portion of the table. Oh, my gosh. Uh-oh. Right here, I kind of like Sue and Tim, to tell you the truth. The way they've been shooting and the way they know the table, I kind of like them. Yep. It's pretty cut and dry.
Yeah. He killed the ball. And Bud and Anthony are going to have to pack their bags until another time. Nice to watch those guys play, though. All right, guys, we're going to take a quick break. We'll be back with another match shortly after this. Thanks for watching this. And uh, please tell a friend. We're still streaming live. And I'm going to get into some action with Jeff Sorensen a little later today. Oh, yeah. Talk to you guys in a minute.